Hello everyone and welcome to the bug access community. Today we are going to see about what are different kind of hashes and how we can identify them. So you might have come across many hashes when you do bug bounty hunting like when you enter the password and the email address it might be encoded in some hash value or the session id might be encoded in some hash value and you need to decrypt them. But I have come across many of my participants or students that uh, they have hard time finding what type of hence encryption it is and they look for everything on the internet that how to identify now. So here I'll give you two minute rule or one minute rule that will make your task much easier and you can find out what it is and you can even decrypt them within uh, 30 seconds to 30, 45 seconds. So let's start. So here I have three values, three hashes of different kind SH, SHJ256, MD5 and Whirlpool. So what we can do is now if you now let's suppose that this is a session ID of some website and you don't know that how to decrypt this so you can do a session overtaking or find a session management flaw. So you will copy this hash value go to Kali Linux machine clear everything and there is a simple command which is hash identifier press enter paste your hash oops So you can see it is SHA256 and the possible hashes are SHA256 and Havel256. So what it will help you? You might go on internet and try every hash possible but here it will narrow down your searches. So now let's try another one. MD5, we'll copy this, we'll paste this. Yeah. So you see, okay, so I was pasting a uh, space key on the last two times which gave me not found, not found. So here you can see possible hashes MD5. We try the last one here. Yes, as such a 5 and 2 and whirlpool. You can see we have whirlpool here. So among SHA 256, 512, MD5, Whirlpool, you have narrowed down your search to just two things. And these are just three cases. There are many hash algorithms which could work. There is MD4, MD3. Anything could be there, but you can narrow down your search with help of hash identifier. So this was a small session and an informative one. So please subscribe to our channel and stay healthy. Have a good day. Bye.